hey guys hope you've all been well so today i'm starting my day by getting a money pedi from lux nails parlor i really really needed this badly i've had such a long week and i needed such a treat Today I'm getting their amazing glow pedicure yet again. This is by far the best pedi I've ever had. I know I have said it before but you all need to try it. Believe me, it's amazing. Next day, I only had one errand and that is shopping for my living room deco. So I stopped by CK Homestyle Interiors. She's at Gigiri Box Park. Uh, don't mind the flickering lights. They were unavoidable. So I literally, literally love every piece of item in her shop. I didn't know what to get and what to leave, honestly. When you want to get off the darkest ground The gravity pulls you straight down I also loved how um, she painted her walls for the shop. They had this lovely rough texture paint. Some parts were mixed with gold and glitter and a light shade of blush pink which I found very very beautiful. She did this wall design all by herself by the way. I wish I could do this in my house. <music>
The next day, I had an appointment with Primp and Cuddle. I was due for an eyebrow touch-up. If you missed the first video on these, uh, mine are actually ombre brows. The gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view You should grow feathers and see this too This is a final look for my eyebrows. This ones will last me two to three years. They're actually oily because I've applied the vitamin ointment, which is supposed to help with the healing and the scabbing. And since I have a lot of errands today, I'll be wearing a cap and not forgetting sunscreen. It helps a lot because I'm not supposed to. I'm actually supposed to avoid direct sunlight. <laughs> So I am packing some snacks for me and my sister. We are going to Isili to shop for some curtains and a new carpet for my living room. So these days I prefer packing food, especially if I know I'll be out the whole day. I really get bad headaches if I skip some meals, especially breakfast. <laughs> Back home, this is the new carpet I got from Isili Moyale Mall, first floor. I'll be unfolding it in the next video. This time I decided to go for grey curtains and I also got new shears for the living and dining room windows. so at the beginning of the year you remember i told you guys i was planning to change my living room theme um i think even sometime last year i said that i was planning to get at least three set of different themes for my um entire house so as much as i've gotten all this new deco i'm not planning to get rid of my old deco i'm just going to wash them if there's something to be washed like the curtains i'm just going to wash and store them in case like um in like three months i get bored of the new decor i can always switch things up so um i'm going to show you guys individually what i got for the living room and this time i thought to go a bit neutral i wanted uh, more of neutral shades and tones in my living room so i'll share with you guys so now i want to take you guys individually through the decos that i got and before i go any further uh, i got my hair done at um beauty space kenya so it has this uh, spanish bulk at the end it's quite long and my eyebrows are actually dark because i went for retouch uh two days ago so that's why they are dark they will shade um and become a bit lighter so don't worry about that so i'm going to take you guys individually uh i'm going to take you guys through um every piece that i got and then next week i'm going to uh, show you guys how i style everything in the living room um what i want to show you that uh i've already gotten our new set of curtains and uh, i got a new carpet i got a new console also um i'm yet to find a few pieces here and there like um i really wanted a fox plant for the corner part of my room uh for the living room uh where i had put my christmas tree but huh, those things are damn expensive you guys so i don't know if i'm going to go through with buying one but if i do um i'll show you guys next week what um I'll get so apart from that I really wanted a burnt orange theme but I don't think 
I, I, for the life of me i can't get uh burnt orange stuff so there's someone i'm working with she's trying to source out things for me here and there so hopefully if we do uh i'll go with the burnt orange theme if not i'll just come up with uh, another theme or i just stick to completely completely having a neutral living room so the first thing i got from ck was huh, i've been eyeing this on her, her instagram page for the longest time it's this orchid and it's quite long by this so this one i'm going to put it in my console so these ones you spread them out however you want so don't worry so this one is ceramic and it's white and it's so pretty i've been eyeing this for a very long time i've had screenshots of this uh plant on my phone for a while so the moment i entered her shop this is the first thing that i got um so this one will be for the console and as you can tell it's quite long because like let me step back see it's quite long and uh yeah this one i got from ck uh home style interiors and okay also the leaves you can like spread them i'll show you guys next week so the next Other thing, thing I that i'm really really excited about from ck are um these jars or they're called vases no, I think they are more in the family of ginger jars than in the family of vases. So I'll show you guys. But you can use as both. So it's this set of vases. This is so cute. So there's this one. This is this is a small one. It has its own lid. So it has a bluish tone at the top and there's the brown nude look at the bottom which I really really love. I thought this one was really really cute. So I'm going to use this one either on my console or my coffee table. I'm not sure yet. So you have the option of removing the lid and you put in your plants at the top. So this is a small one. So there's a larger one. Let me show you. So this is a big one as you can see compared to my head it's quite big so this one doesn't have the blue tone at the at the top it's more of just a, a lovely neutral um cream look and it also has the nude look at the bottom and it also has its own um lid so you can st you can opt to style them with the lids on or you remove them and you put your plants um inside and look this is Quite beautiful I really really loved this um, I thought it was really cute and it would look really elegant in my living room so they come this set of this two. so tune in next week to see how I style both of these in my living room the next thing I got from CK was this candle holder um, it's in silver. I don't know if it will go very well with my dining uh, room deco, but I think it will because I have more of grays, so it will go perfectly with it. So this one I also got from CK. It's quite beautiful and elegant if you ask me. To the big candle holders, uh, not candle holders, the big candles from Bath and Body Works on top, and it will look, look, hey, hey, it will look really, really beautiful. So those are the four items i got from ck so let me show you guys the stuff i got from house of leather so these are the other set of vases i got from house of leather um they're in rose gold shade and these ones i'll use on my console and i really really love them the thing is i think rose gold goes uh very well with like blush pink so i'm debating whether to take all my blush pink throw pillow covers to the living room so that they can go very well with i don't know why it's looking gold but i promise you guys it's actually rose gold <laughs> so i'll show you guys how i'll style this with so I'm really excited about these flowers or oh, their leaves. They're not flowers. I think they're, <laughs> they're leaves. So I got these ones from House of Leather and they're in the shade. There's actually one that's like completely uh, white. So this is white and this one has more of rose gold in it. So let me switch off the light so that you can see the, um, what I'm talking about exactly. 
there so this one is more of rose gold it not rose gold it has um some gold in the leaves and this one is plain uh white so what i'll do i'll just like interchange them in between because they create such a beautiful contrast um when they are mixed in between each other so i got two sets this this and this so these ones are for my console and a coffee table hopefully i may decide to change things around so we'll see next week so as much as i'm saying i'll go neutral i think i'll still keep uh, a bit of yellow in the living room if i don't decide to move the blush pink theme um to the living room I, I know i sound very undecided but trust me by end of the week everything will have fallen into place so i got this lovely pr package from um laka luxurious deco so she gave me this lovely um woven basket um so this one has a yellow color the bottom and um, the neutral shade at the top so the other basket that i have in my living room for keeping blankets is also the same same design just that this one doesn't have handles but they go very well um together the other lovely lovely thing she got me let me show you guys i really really love this by the way something i'll never have thought of getting but seeing it was like oh my god why didn't i think of this and it's quite beautiful Ooh. check this out a magnifying glass so this one i'll use as a deco piece for my coffee table you'll see how i'll style it and it looks so beautiful so this is such a cute piece thank you so much laka this is something i'll never have thought of but i really really love i can't wait to see this on my coffee table every day so please check out her page she has amazing things let me tell you she has amazing things so check out her page so the next items are actually a PR package I got from Sleek Vases and I thought they were really really cute. So I think they custom make these vases that have um, these fox plants on top. So let me show you guys what they sent to me. So these are the vases that um, she sent to me. It's quite heavy actually. So check out the pot details. So this one is really lovely. It has gold on top, some blue and white. I thought this design was really, really beautiful. And then it has a lovely orchid uh, plant on top, which is white and purple. I know it looks pink, but it's a bit... Um, yes that's purple so it's white and purple so i think this one i'm going to put in my dining table um dining room so i'll show you guys how i style these pieces so they come a set of three so let me show you guys the others it's quite heavy i hope it doesn't break the glass so the other set um the other vases are these ones so there's this and there are two. Sorry, my hair is stuck. So these are the other ones. Let me open. I know she closed. So this is how um, the other set looks like so I'll put this in the middle and this um, on both sides but I think it actually looks really good with this net I don't know but I really love the whole um, blue and gold mixture in the vases I think it looks really really cute um, so these are from sleek vases so check out her page she has other designs by there she has plain white pots um and i think she can make any color you want so please inquire from her and i thought this this ones look really really beautiful so thank you thank you so much uh sleek vases for this i really really love them a lot 
so i also got a really lovely lovely package um with assorted items for the kitchen and for the house from stylish utensils girl thank you thank you so much i really really love all these items so let me share with you guys so the first thing she sent was this um container so this is a fridge container where you can store your vegetables in the fridge let me remove the cover so you can store your vegetables in the fridge and you can pile i think even three three or four can be piled on top of each other per shelf in the fridge so these are perfect for organizing um inside your fridge you can store your i think the only thing they can't fit is like tomatoes but carrots um parsley's all your danias and your chilies everything i think even unless you slice like your peppers and you put them here your green and red and yellow peppers i think this is such a really really lovely um thing to have in the house it will help a lot in organizing the fridge especially if you have um like a medium fridge like mine um you need such things to organize so the other thing was this uh collapsible I think I think it's for washing vegetables. Yes. So you like oh it's opening on it. Yeah. Let me open it. Yeah. So this one is for watching hey <laughs> it's for washing your um uh, vegetables in the kitchen like um your spinach your cabbage and then it has a nozzle it has um this section over here where you can pull it out and you drain um the water and you leave the vegetables drying so things like lettuce if you wash them you put them here and you leave this um thing open for it to dry properly and your skumas and cabbages and then when you're done you just fold it back I think I've over folded you fold it back and you can even use this as a cutting board actually you cut like uh, for me I usually like chop my cabbages in the house so i buy it whole and chop it so you can chop on top of it it's actually hard so you can chop your cabbages here then you open it up you wash the cabbage you let it dry and you cook actually this is such a nifty idea i really love 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 this thing and it will really come in handy in my kitchen so thank you thank you so much stylish utensils for this I really really like it so let me show you guys i stood up before finishing the sentence let me show you guys the other things that she um sent so there's this toilet cleaner i bet you've all like seen it on ig yes, I'm both. this one so this is how the brush looks inside and it's quite flexible you can get into the inner part of the toilet um to better wash it so this i really really like this is nice i think i'm going to get another one for my guest bathroom so this one i'm going to put um in the master bathroom but uh quite like it actually and the another bottom thing part she got um was this quite like this let me show you so it's some sort of organizer it has three partitions i think this is for the boot uh you can put it um in the boot of your car and you put your heels here like your spare clothes and uh, anything else like water you want to organize the boot for your car i think this is really really nice i like it i always throw things at the back uh seat of my car so this one would really come in handy for me i really like this this Thank you so much. This is this is very very nice. Um so what else did she send me? There's something else. Oh, a bucket and a mop. Let me show you guys. It's already in the kitchen cuz I already used it to mop uh, my entire house cuz I was really really excited to use it and see how it works.
so the last thing I want to share with you guys are these lovely hair buns I got from glam by Ivy these ones have been so helpful to me when it comes to cleaning. I'm always in braids. Most of the time my hairstyle is braids. So I usually use this to like hold my hair up while I'm cleaning or cooking. Check out these lovely prints. She has such amazing prints and this one is in plain white and then they are quite um, stretchable. She's made them from stretchable fabric. So she sent um, these lovely prints and I also have others from her before. There's this um, lovely polka dots one and there's this uh, pink and blue. It's, left. it's a very lovely floral one. They're also very stretchable and these are plain black one that I have that I use quite um, a lot. So it's somewhere somewhere around so check out her page for some lovely hair bands even um, if you use like your weave this and if you wear weaves sorry or wigs especially wigs these ones will come very very handy and I find them quite cute she has varieties you can choose from so these are the ones that she sent to me girl these ones will help me especially when I'm doing my cleaning videos you'll be seeing me wearing um, these hair bands from her which I think are really really cute and they're actually quite wide they're not like the really narrow one this this one the first one is a bit narrow so these ones are a bit wide so you can select um, the kind of size you want and the patterns and the colors she has them all trust me so check out her page she's called glam by ivy and I think I'm sorted when it comes to hair bands Thank you so much.